the coral story is kind of almost the most depressing one. Oh, here we go. Yeah, so get your beer ready. Buddy. Yeah. It's, it's <laughs> uh, yeah, coral, coral around the world is uh, incredibly threatened. It's, in threatened. it's threatened because the climate is changing. So when coral gets too hot, uh, it bleaches. And coral is sort of a symbiotic thing between a plant and a little bug and... They live together and they're oh, happy no and har harmonious. That, right? Yeah, uh -huh. um, and when uh, uh, when it gets too hot, one of them just bails. <laughs> okay, they're like, I'm out of here. We're done with this. I've been in that relationship. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, now, if it's not severe bleaching, the coral can come back. Okay. But if it's really severe, then the coral literally dies, and so coral all around the world is being threatened by global warming. Um, but it's not just being threatened by the warming. The ocean also absorbs uh, like a third of the CO2 we put in the air. So we put CO2 in the atmosphere, it gets warmer, right? Uh -huh. But some of that CO2 goes in the oceans and it makes the oceans more acidic. And, and, as, it's, uh, and as the acidity of the ocean increases, then it's harder for corals to grow new coral, to grow oh, okay. new stuff. And other critters that grow shells and things like that, they have a harder time. So heat, acidity. And the last one is overfishing. Overfishing. Yeah, okay. uh, the you know uh, corals tend to hold, hold an entire ecosystem. So when uh, when the coral bleaches, it's a whole ecosystem that's lost. Uh, there's all these little fish that depend on the coral, and then other fish that depend on those fish, and it's a whole it's a whole food chain. Okay. And so uh, they uh, as they um, as overfishing takes out a lot of the other species, then it's harder for the coral to come back. It winds up being harder for them to kind of regrow. I gotcha. Yeah. So, so I, I think you anticipated my question here, which is why should I give a shit about coral? Yeah. Which is that it's, it's the basis for a whole ecosystem of the ocean, right. and I like seafood. Right, right. exactly. Okay, yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's also uh, the most rapidly disappearing uh, species oh, or animals. So it gets yeah. a prize. Right, exactly. No, it is. Okay. It is. So all other uh, all other species that are endangered are less endangered than coral. Wow. Yeah. Well, I had no idea. Now, I, I do want I, I want to end on a little positive note. Oh, how fun. Yes, all right. I know. Here we go. Uh, there are some researchers who are studying ways to like regrow coral. Oh, nice. Now, they're not going to fix the whole problem and they're trying a lot of things, but they're trying to grow these kind of like trees uh -huh. that allow uh, uh, and, and seed coral, certain types of coral in, in, into the reefs to help them regrow after the bleaching events. And it's sort of working. They're figuring it out, but they're trying to at least make efforts to reduce the impact. So. Well, I wish them well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that that is fascinating. I, I didn't realize that it was so important. I was always like, "Why yeah, are we going cool. on and on about coral? <laughs> right, it's right. pretty, but yeah. a lot of things. Okay, yeah. that's yeah, that's yeah. great to know. Okay, so we are truly screwed. Definitely. All right. Podpocalypse.